All right, Mo. Mike Brown caved once. Does he need to cave again? Yeah, he does. Uh, look, Mike Brown is getting a lot of accolades, and deservedly so for what he did on Tuesday with the Carson Palmer trade. Ultimately, what was more important was the overall health of his franchise and not his own personal battle of wills. That's a good thing. He's getting credit, deservedly so. I'm happy for him. He needs to take it a step further. Through the work of Mike Brown, the coaching staff, and everybody involved, they have put themselves in a really good, really advantageous, and really luxurious position. They've got a good team right now, at least a promising team, and they're set in most of the important positions on a football team. They also go into next year's draft in a position unlike anything this team has ever experienced before. They can essentially run the draft, and there's a number of options for them. Obviously, they can use the picks to fortify what they already have. They can trade picks for players. They can trade picks for even more picks. But what they've done so far and what they do over the course of the next couple of drafts are obviously going to reverberate for the next maybe decade. This is a vital time, and you could argue if the Bengals are ever going to be relevant, if they're ever going to sustain long-term success, it's going to happen now. The seeds have been planted now, and it's going to keep growing for the next couple of years. If it doesn't happen now, you could argue it might not ever happen. And so this team is going to have some very important decisions in front of it. The Bengals could blow it. They are the Bengals. And you could say that about a lot of different teams. The draft is a crapshoot. But heading into this important decision-making process, a big, big draft, I want the most qualified person making those decisions. And with all due respect to what Mike Brown has done with the Carson Palmer situation, with all due respect to the player acquisitions this summer and the draft of this past April, and some other drafts as well, I want somebody from the outside making these moves. And so, Mike Brown, if you're feeling it and you're starting to like people actually writing nice things about you and saying nice things about you, if you're starting to understand how good that feels, cave again. Hire a general manager and put him in charge of the draft that you have set up. Make this about the team. You've done it once. Do it again. Hire a GM and sit back and watch people like me write and say nice things about you yet again. Email me, mo at ESPN1530.com, and send me a tweet as well, at moegger1530.